Guys, it's literally spring. I don't know how this lighting looks. I'm gonna actually shoot myself if it looks crap. I feel like I'm gonna have to test it before we continue shooting because I actually like how I look today. I've got my orange juice switch tastes like not the best. So guys, it's the first day of spring being the reason why I'm here today. Also, meet my plants. This is Philly and this is Ali. If you guys have been with me for a while, you will know about Randall, who was my other plant. I was looking for him in the garden this morning. He died. He was thrown away. I went looking for him, couldn't find him. Uh, I have an emotional attachment to plants. And I'm proud of it. I got this. Okay, so let me just explain the whole, you know, how I look. Um, so it's the first day of spring. I thought it would be rude if I didn't embrace it. So I put my spring colors on. It's this like a uh, blue and white shirt dress. It's supposed to have like a cleavage situation, but I just will never have cleavage <laughs> in my life. I, my hair, I did it in like summery plaits. Um, very long today. I got, I got my orange juice. I'm really embracing the spring uh so i've decided to scrap everything i'm doing i'm gonna get ready and just you know have a fun spring day i'm also vlogging today because well i was supposed to go to the gym that didn't happen um i am supposedly i might be going up to london I'm not 100 percent sure wait for my dad to hear back from the electrician but oh i'm gonna show you how ghetto my setup is for just one second i literally have my makeup box here uh a hair box a candle old setting spray no that's not setting spray old um fuck, what is this setting powder and this is my lighting lamp so yeah we're gonna get ready today i think we're gonna do like what it would be rude if i didn't do a spring look whatever a spring look is so like kind of like light glowy you know what do we think about the hair it either gives like Okay, same as this shirt though, like I give hospital vibes. Also guys, sorry, my foundation might be just ever so slightly a little bit darker. Um, you know, I am fake tanning at the moment and obviously it's spring, so I'm a bit more tanned at the moment. I thrive in the spring. I don't, not even in the spring, just in the sunny weather in general. Like there's something about it which I come out of, you know, I come out of, you know, my shell kind of thing, um, which I, I'm sure is like a lot of us. Um, spring, okay, I mean, like I'm born in spring, like maybe that's why I just like, you know, when it is winter, like I don't like to go out. Um, you know, I've become extremely unsociable in winter. I don't know when this video is gonna go up in what order. This might be my first video or this might be not my first video if it's not my first video then you'll know um i use the exact same products which doesn't make sense because i'm doing like a light summer look and the last video i did my everyday looks i'm using the l'oreal skin paradise um tinted moisturizer which is a really nice um it's got spf in it which is obviously perfect for spring it's just like a light glowy tinted moisturizer oh, oh sorry let me guys let me show you guys my necklace my mum made me this necklace you can't see it too well right now uh, she also made me this ring and this ring here this one was for my 18th this one's for my 19th this is for my 20th they are the only things in the world that if i was to lose i would never get over it like you could actually take anything from me like you could lose literally anything if i lost those rings or the necklace i would never I honestly don't think I'd ever recover from it. Completely forgot to blend into my neck, um, which looked, you know, bad. No, it's not getting any better. Okay, now we're gonna go on to concealer. Um, this wouldn't usually be used on my like light makeup but i can't seem to find my other concealer but this is the pink honey camo concealer i fuck with this concealer so hard it's so good you get so much product for starters I, it sounds like i'm doing an ad i seriously am not um but if you guys are like on my tiktok and stuff you'll know i like don't shut up about this stuff anyway it's the pink camo concealer in the shade bite the bullet and i just take my little brush just apply it where you would apply concealer so just a bit under the eyes and then like a bit here you're literally just under the heart all of my eye really so i've definitely just like put so much on i didn't clean my brushes before this video i should, probably should have because they are gross 
but you know there's not much we can do about it now oh also sorry guys my windows are open and you can probably hear rain it's confusing so ignore like the lawn mowers there is someone mowing their grass at the moment um the rain sound is my siri pod so i have this little siri pod hey siri Hey Siri. Hi there. I feel good. Thanks for asking. Oh. Don't know who you are. Check. I am someone who just can't sit in silence. He plays rain sounds all day long. Okay, so let me tell you my plans for today. I think we're going up to London. It's gonna help me take some pics and stuff. And then we're gonna probably go for some nice lunch. Uh, not too sure where yet, but there's a really nice area in London uh, called Belgravia, which has the most unreal cafes and stuff so i thought we'd go there very bouge very on the uh on the upscale side of things but it's spring it just doesn't get any better okay <laughs> okay so we're just gonna apply a bit of concealer to our foreheads just because I know you can all see how badly I'm breaking out. I always forget to put the lid back on my products and then they dry out. And then I'm like, wow, my products is crap. It's okay, now we're just going to use the Revolution Conceal and Hydrate Concealer in the shade C6. Just under my brows. I haven't done anything to my brows. Oh, my... I literally collect nail glue so that if my nails fall off, just stick them back on until I can get them sorted. I don't think there's orange juices in day. Well, I was saying, we're gonna just put a bit of concealer under my eyebrows. I haven't done my eyebrows fully yet. And we're just gonna blend. Um, I was about to say, which I'm really excited for. And I like doing them this way around, filling them in. Uh, no, sorry, carving them before filling them in because Makeup by Harish told me to and she uh, knows what she's talking about. And I don't when it comes to makeup. So I'm just gonna take any excess off. Now we're just gonna lightly bronze. Oh, that's a lie. We're gonna bronze to the gods because we're doing a spring look. We're gonna take our um, pink honey. So look at all my hair, how I just, you know, my hair is everywhere. We're gonna use the pink honey um, bronzing face frosting um, in the shade Bite the Bullet. I go over top with this stuff. I think pink honey is one of my favorite makeup brands. And then we're just gonna. And then we're just, you know, lightly putting it in the our cheeks. One place I'd really love to go today is Christmas Tree Farm. If you guys know about Christmas Tree Farm, then you know. If you don't know about Christmas Tree Farm, it's just a farm. Like, really not actually that great. It's just a little farm and the only farm you can really visit around here. Like, in the spring, it's such a vibe. But it's the kind of place, like, if you don't bring a child, people will look like she's here on her own. And I would so go there on my own. But it would look a bit odd that I'm on my own, you know, without a child, like, I, you know. And you get buckets to feed the animals, which is like makes me so, oh my, oh my God. So my, there was a puppy outside our, it wasn't actually a puppy, it was a dog outside our house today. Um, it had escaped its house. It was just sitting on the road. And um, can you hear that, the ice cream van? Ice cream van, in fact, is uh, the guy who drives it is Greek. And when he found out our family was Greek, he used to turn up every single day pretty much and like wait outside. Like he'd always make such a con conscious effort to stop by our house. And I feel really bad because like we literally went like twice and then we never went back. I guarantee it'll be here. Okay, we're just gonna do a bit on our forehead. Oh God, you know, it looks good in my mirror, but how it looks on camera. Bronzed. I should really check if this is in day. I always have to be a lot lighter with my makeup on YouTube videos or even TikTok videos because when I come to doing it on like, you know, pictures for my Instagram or whatever, you know, face up is a hero, which just sorts it all out for me. There's no filter on here, which means I have to actually, you know, <laughs> make my makeup look good. And we always take our contour into our brows. And then we like to do a bit on our eyebrows because the one, the main thing about glowy natural makeup is, oh, it has to look seamless, you know? So that's why we go in with our contour and we use it in our eyelids. Um, we use it um, 
we used to say bronzer color everywhere it also just gives that kind of like natural bronzed effect on your eyelids one thing i'm genuinely worried about is when i move out is having to deal with spiders i know it seems like such a oh my god like get over it like you know like it's literally a spider but you know you can't tell someone that he genuinely has a crippling fear of spiders you know like and people do have fears of spiders i know you know so many people who are genuinely terrified and one of those people is me and i'm genuinely terrified for the day that i move out and i've got to kill okay i uh, sorry i've said kill i don't want to kill the spider no but my automatic response is throw you know as far away distance as possible and i'm just being honest like i'm not gonna sit here and be like guys i'd never kill a spider because i'm fucking petrified of it we always carve and then you just like you know i feel like because it's spring vibes we should go for like a thumbnail i'm gonna go for this one because this one is the perfect oh should take a shot for how many times i mentioned the word spring in this video so we're gonna take my blush brush oh i didn't actually even set my face you know i just am really excited to get out clearly i've got a test tomorrow which i'm not excited for by the time you see this the test will be well over with. I'm seeing everyone go on holiday right now, which I mean, I am jealous. We're just gonna quickly set our faces just because I don't want the creams to revolution. Best setting spray. And we're just gonna go on uh, brows. Um, so we're gonna use the Pink Honey Wonder Whip. And it came with a little angle brush. But I just fill in any sparse areas. My SD card just completely packed up okay we are now gonna powder bronze using our um dull beauty give me some bronzer these products are the only products i use also i've decided i'm gonna solo travel i've been wanting to travel europe for the longest time but i was always so scared to do it not not for the fact on my own just because everyone was like oh it might be a bit dangerous or you know you have to be careful and also look at how i've done this sorry about that like, i don't know what's stopping me so i've decided there's literally nothing stopping me so i'm just gonna go and do it i actually think i prefer my own company in general so actually that's the topic one thing i've really learned about myself is that i really enjoy my own company i'm very sociable i can talk to anyone will talk to anyone otherwise i talk to myself going to restaurants on my own taking myself out for dinners on my own there's just something about it which is just just unmatched i'm just putting some eyeliner on quickly i'm using the Zoll beauty um push popping liner mm -hmm. i'm gonna use the becca highlighter they're very small it's about this size also i want to apologize if these topics have just been like all over the place i was going to organize questions like i said at the beginning but i thought you know we were just going to let it flow and see what we spoke about i feel like we've covered quite a few things i don't know maybe maybe not but one thing oh my god so one thing i've been like talking to myself about i've decided to take up hobbies again i feel like as we get older we stop hobbies and i just don't I think it's sad like when we're younger we have all these things that we enjoy doing and we have these hobbies and things that make us happy but like we you know, we just like stop doing them when we get to a certain age so i've decided i'm gonna start again and i think this should be your sign to also start again why would we not take our old hobbies back up so i'm getting back into painting i can show you guys some of my paintings in a minute if you want or maybe not no maybe i'll do a few more then i'll show you guys long i cannot sit still for any amount of time without getting irritable and needing to move unless i'm painting and i used to go to an arts class in school and like i really used to enjoy it and so i thought like why did i stop if you don't have one or you've never had one we should as a collective go out and find them i think it's so important to have one something to do outside of work and something to do you know outside of you just doing nothing because i think doing nothing is also really important you know like we shouldn't feel bad about having days that we do nothing um so i think as a collective we should all go and find our hobbies again 
um, and start them out. I just applied some of Bobbi Brown Cool Sugar on my cheeks. So, our lip colour we're going to use. Oh, am I done? I feel like I'm probably missing a major step, but whatever. I've been watching the um, Hollywood Fix at the moment. I'm obsessed. I'm actually obsessed with the Hollywood Fix. I sit there and I can watch it for hours. You guys will probably see when you click on my channel, my liked videos. I guarantee to you the Hollywood Fix is there. Let's drop my lip liner. Hold on. Okay, for lips, we're going to use the Revolution. I think it's in the shade Heart 8. It's from Revolution, though. Oh, my, oh my God. I keep dropping it. I just picked it up with my tie. <laughs> but we're just honestly going to use it all over my lips. It's like the perfect spring colour, you know? And I personally love Revolution liners. I think they're incredible. You cannot tell me that is the most pretty shade. And then we're just going to go on to mascara. I'm going to do my mascara off camera because I never look good when putting mascara on. And, you know, I'll just sit here, like, you know, this is not looking that great. How do I get this off? Yeah, I just had to cover it up with highlighter. So my nose highlight might look a bit crazy, but, you know, we all know why. What do we think? What do we think? This is the finished look. I think it's spring vibes. I think I like it. I can't honestly tell through the, through the viewfinder, but... What I see here looks okay. But I'm going to be annoying and you guys are going to see my outfit on my vlog. Because um, I'm going to be that type of YouTuber. No, I'm just kidding. I'll insert my outfit in the end. But yeah, this is my look. I hope you guys like it. Um, it doesn't sit right with me when I say it. But like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.